At the end of this video, you'll know how to create a client's chart, create an intake appointment, how to add signatures to documents, and how to have the client sign those documents. To create a client's chart in Best Notes, you will navigate to the top left-hand corner and within the search bar, type in the client's last name. You will then review the search results to verify this client wasn't already created within Best Notes. Once you have verified that this is a new client, select New Client. This will open the New Client window, where you can enter the client's contact information and demographics. Once you have that information, you will need to assign the client's accessible by or access tags. Access tags are like a filing cabinet within Best Notes. You are filing your client based on their status. The inquiry leads tag is intended for any potential clients or clients that haven't come in and received an official start date. The current active tag is intended for current clients who do have a start date. The past discharge tag is intended for clients that have discharged from the program. Once you assign the appropriate tag, you will be able to select Save. You will be taken to the client's chart, where you can update any contact information or demographics by selecting the client's name. Record the client's insurance information or upload any outside documents. Now that the client chart has been created, you will schedule this client for their intake appointment. To go back to the main dashboard to view the calendar, select the Calendar button in the bottom left-hand corner. Navigate to the day you would like to schedule the appointment by using the arrows at the very top of the calendar or by selecting the desired day within the calendar on the left-hand side. Once you have the date pulled up, you will select the time you would like to schedule the appointment. Once in the new appointment window, verify that the date and time are correct. Next, select the correct appointment type. This appointment type dropdown includes the standard appointment types pre-built within your database. If you would like to know more about creating standard or customized appointment types, see the System Setup video. For this intake appointment, you will select the Client Intake Appointment Type. Some appointment types can be set up by the system administrator to have specific documents generate when beginning the appointment. It is very important that you select the appropriate appointment type. Now that you have the appointment type selected, you will want to add the client to the appointment. Type in the client's first or last name, review the search results generated, and select your client from the list. Once you select your client, it will add the client's name within the contacts area of the attendees tab. Next, verify that the provider and the facility are correct and select Save when you are finished. To begin an appointment, first open the appointment by left-clicking, then verify the client, provider, and facility. Then select Check-in when you are ready. Once you check in, the documents that are tied to the appointment type will automatically open. This will allow you to work through the documents during the appointment. The documents generated with this standard client intake appointment type include an example admission packet and the pre-screen intake assessment. To have your company's admission packet added to your best notes, send your packet to team at bestnotes.com and our support or implementation team will create that admissions packet for you. The pre-screen intake assessment is part of the best notes documentation profile set, which we will review later in the clinical documentation video. Once you have finished with these documents, you will want to be sure you are reviewing who is added as a signer. This will be important on every document that is completed within Best Notes. The signatures will always be located at the top left-hand corner of your document. If you need to add the client or a supervising provider as a signer, you want to make sure you are seeing those names on this lighter gray line. When you are working on an assessment or a treatment plan, once you have reviewed your signers, you will select Publish Snapshot. When you see the first prompt, this will inform you that you are adding this to the client's activity log, select OK. Then you will receive a prompt that will add your electronic signature to the document, select OK. When you are working with templates or admission packets, you will want to review your signers again, add any signers that are necessary, and then you will select Save, Sign, and Lock. This is the equivalent to publishing a snapshot. It will lock the document, add your electronic signature, and add the document to the client's activity log. Once these items are added to the activity log, they will have the Signature Required button. To capture the client's signature, navigate to the client's chart. You can get to that chart by left-clicking the appointment and then selecting the green arrow in front of the client's name. Now you are at the client's chart 
and you can locate the documents that require the client's signature. If your client has never set up their four-digit PIN or has forgotten their four-digit PIN, you can navigate to the top of the client's chart and select the piece of paper with a pencil to create or reset their PIN. Selecting this icon will lock the main screen so you can allow the client to enter their PIN without sharing any protected health information. The client should be the only person that knows their PIN and must enter it in themselves. Once the client has entered their PIN number twice and selected Submit, you will see a PIN saved successfully message. Select OK. Then you will unlock your best notes by entering your password and selecting Unlock. Now that the client has created or reset their PIN, you can select the Signature Required button. This will open the document in a new window and lock the main best notes screen again. This allows the client to review what they are signing and in the bottom left-hand corner of the document, they will enter their four-digit PIN and select Sign. You can then unlock your best notes by entering your password and selecting Unlock. You now know how to create a client chart, create an intake appointment, add signers to a document, and have clients sign documents. If you have any questions about what was covered in this video, you can reach out to Best Notes Support.